I've started this YouTube channel so that I can share with you some of the time-lapse videos that I've taken this year of some of the larger projects that I've been working on. I'm going to start with uh, one of my most dedicated clients. Uh, he's called Michael. He travels all the way from Australia to get tattooed by me here in the UK, um, Norwich. We're actually working on a bodysuit, but we started with um, his back uh, in just two sessions last December, I think. And when he was back here in September, uh, we decided to start taking time-lapse videos. Um, not just for him, so that also I could use them to show other prospective clients how large-scale pieces progress. Because um, there's lots of weird stages that large projects go through where it looks really unfinished and it's difficult to see where it's going. When Michael first inquired about a tattoo, um, he'd mentioned that he wanted a bodysuit. Um, but to be honest, when I first read the email, I didn't realise that he wanted me to do it. Um, I'd only been tattooing about a year and a half at that point, and frankly, the idea of doing a bodysuit terrified me. <laughs> but I'm really glad that he chose me to do it. With regards to his back piece, his original idea was really vague. Um, he just said that he would quite like a tiger, and he was happy for me to kind of do what I wanted with it. Earlier that year, I had already completed one tiger back piece, um, which was more of a calm tiger. Um, it was this one. Uh, you might have already seen it on my Instagram if you follow me. Um, if not, it's at Hannah underscore tattoos. Um, so go follow me. So when I was thinking about what to do with Michael's back, um, I wanted to try and have something that was a bit more energetic um, as that was quite a calm serene pose for that tiger um, and we eventually settled on the idea of having two tigers fighting um, with sort of a jungle scene background so when he was here last year uh, we did two days in a row uh, completing both the tigers heads so the video follows three days in a row of tattooing because Michael is either very brave or slightly crazy um, and I wouldn't do that with every client do three days in a row um, but Michael has an extremely high pain threshold so I was working in sections over these three days um, and you can kind of tell when the end of one day finishes and the start of the next one begins during the course of the video as you'll see a brand new piece of stencil applied um, I tend to keep my stencils really, really simple. Uh, I find it easier to follow and I feel like it gives me slightly more, I don't want to say artistic flair, but artistic flair. If you enjoyed this video, please uh, click subscribe because I will be posting more videos to this YouTube channel um, of not just this project, but other projects that I've got going on as well.
I will be doing more videos about this project in particular and also other projects that are coming.